What's up friends, Chuck here, and welcome back to Resident Evil 2 HD Remake Remaster Re Fancy Pants. Uh, we are in the orphanage. Uh, Nick has been stolen by Eyeball Joe, um, and Officer Shitlips has been killed by uh, Eyeball Joe. So, the only thing for us to do is to go down this ladder and no doubt fight Eyeball Joe for the second time. Or, it's a new Eyeball Joe, we're not sure. But, uh, I mean, this is the only way to go, so that's what we're doing. Uh, let's see what there is. There's some pipage. There's, oh god, okay. Sherry! Where are you? Who's Sherry? All I know is Newt. Claire! Sherry! I'll be right there! There is no Dana, only Zool. Alright, Eyeball Jerry, where you at? Climb the fence? <laughs> I mean, look, there's no barbed wire, there's no nothing. Just cl climb the fence. Uh, can we interact with her? No? Okay. Oh. Oh, it's the Terminator! Go, go, go. It's the Terminator! Claire, it's, behind you. it's the Terminator Don't without stop. a hat. It's not Oval Joe at all. Run, Newt! Don't stand there! What are you doing? Okay, we did it. Oh, shit. Shoot him! Shoot him in the face! Oh, I will Joe to the rest. I will Joe's our friend, man. Apart from the time he tried to kill us. Oh. Oh. Okay, well, Terminator can't be killed apart from if you're a Eyeball Joe. All they needed to do was to jump when the elevator landed, and they wouldn't have died, right? <laughs> that, that old chestnut. Can you hear me? Claire? Claire, you have to get up. He's going to get us. Yeah. It's a good call. Wake up! I don't know if there's two Terminators, because we shot one's hat off and we got achievement for it. Wake up. Wake up. And the one that was chasing us around the department, the police department, had definitely had a hat. So it makes me think there's two. Now one. Sherry. Where's Sherry? Sherry. Sherry's fine. Do you know Sherry? She just said Impressive she's fine. display of strength. What happened to her? We have to assess the situation. Who are you? I'm Claire. I didn't foresee this. Excuse me. Where is she? Hello? What? Where oh, she? Annette. Tell me, what happened to William? I don't know. Who's, who is that? The creature responsible for this. William, what are you doing, man? Can you help me find Sherry? Seems to be evolving much faster than expected. He's not evolving into a dolphin either. Where are you going? Look, I don't have time to play 20 questions. Everything's under control. Doesn't I need to find Sherry. Like My daughter is not your concern. Oh, shit! Dun, dun, dun. All right. Well, Eyeball Joe is gone. Oh no, we were using this to save ammo, weren't we? Her daughter. Apparently so. Go? Um, when the Terminator was chasing us, I was just running in the linear path. Obviously, I don't know if there was any items or anything that I missed. Hello, sailor. Uh, but I doubt it because you're running. But maybe I don't know. Uh, we can go down there. It looks like. We can't go through here. Oh, okay. Oh, box and typewriter and, and well, yeah, typewriter. There we go. Nice. Uh, is that a first aid spray? No, I don't know. What is that? Either way. Report about G. Okay. The G virus uh, clinical trial will be entering its final phase very soon. Before G, the new creature that will su surpass humans, is born, allow me to predict a few things about its biology and biological 
functions. Intelligent. Intelligence. <laughs> intelligence. The subject's intelligence will begin to drop immediately with their ling uh, linguistic abilities disappearing within a matter of days. Okay, so is Eyeball Joe G? Uh, finally, they will lose their capacity of reason and their humanity, or is G Terminator? G will be a creature of pure instinct, driven only by a need to survive and reproduce. Physical abilities. Due to its unusual accelerated soul division evolution, uh, it will be highly adaptable to any environment. Furthermore, with its amazing ability to repair itself through regeneration, it will be extremely difficult to completely kill it with any conventional small firepower. Okay, so again, this could be either of them. Reproductive behavior. G's most remarkable feature will be its intense desire to reproduce. It will instinctively search out humans with DNA that closely matches its own and implant an embryo in them. But the chances of success are very low if the DNA is not close enough of a match. An underdeveloped G creature will produce instead. I suppose the only ones who might be a close enough match would be any biological children of the subject though. Okay, so I'm tipping G then is... Oh, this is nasty! I'm tipping G is Eyeball Joe. And he's going to try and impregnate Newt? Uh, that's, that's fucking weird, man. That's weird. Alright. What do we got here? High-powered rounds. Nice. Um, I don't know if we can use that. High-powered rounds for the SL-60. Is that what this is? I think that might be the SL-60, actually. Either way. Uh, now with more gunpowder goodness. The punch these delivers requires a stronger gun frame to fire. Okay, so is this the SL-60? It's not. It's the JMB HP-3. And the MQ-11. And the GM-79. Okay, so there's a gun that we haven't got yet. Um, anything else? Some towels? No? Okay, well, let's put that away. Let's put that away. Let's put that away. Let's move that there. We've got six slots. Is that enough? Uh, we kind of need... Oh, man, we're all pistol ammo. Uh, we kind of need all this stuff, right? We need the ammos. We need the grenade. Oh, that was not what I meant to do. Take out. I mean, maybe we don't need the grenade because we've got the, 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 the knife. Yeah, okay. I mean, we can use the grenade by itself rather than a fallback thing. If something, like, bites us in the neck. But we'll, I think we'll keep what we've got there. Uh, is there anything that I got then that I need to inspect? Well, we got this, right? We didn't inspect that yet. Not that it's going to do anything. Examine, whatever, but... Okay, look, we got three of these. Clearly, there's more than three. There's one, two, three, four right there. There's another six there. That's ten. And they, look, there's, there's shitloads of them. So, I don't know what she's... Can we actually read this? No. Warning, keep out of reach of children. Okay. Nothing special about them at all. Um, okay, so let's have a save. Let's go back out here. It says we can hold this. Oh, no. Can I get back up? Sherry? No, can I wanted to go through me? that other door. I didn't know what that did. Sherry? Oh, can we load? <laughs> let's load, right? Uh... It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Sherry? Can we even go through the door? <laughs> of course we can't. Brilliant. All right. Well, look. No worries. No worries at all. We get to hear Sherry again. No, we don't. Sherry, can you hear me? Sherry? Okay, I'm ready to go. Come at me. Okay, this is reminding me of the depths. Oh, from Dark Souls 1. That was super loud. Where's the giant rats and stuff? Yeah, that's right. But you're a strong, independent woman. It doesn't matter if you smell like shit. Okay, we've got herbage. 
uh, blue herb. Maybe we leave it for the moment? What is this? Okay, we need something. So we're gonna have to come back here anyway. So we'll leave the herbage for a moment. We need a, a, a crank thing, a, 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 a turny, a turny circle? Technical term. We need a turny circle. Uh, no doubt stuff is gonna come through these and it's gonna suck us. Or there's gonna be like zombie crocodiles down here or some, some crap. Okay, it's just water. I can hear something there. I don't know if it's just the bubbling of sewage or... We're gonna take this slow. Because we know that there's gonna be jump scare, right? It's just how this works. Okay, high-powered gun... High-powered gunpowder. Whatever it is, we're gonna take it. Uh, because it's small and I'm most likely gonna forget that it's there. Can you imagine walking through diarrhea? It's probably not the best. Uh, not only because... Obvious reasons. It's smelling like shit and it being nasty as hell and... Da da da, but also you're gonna get really sick. Okay. What do we got? I'm still waiting for the, like... A zombie to come down flying down here like it's in a, um, like a water slide or something. Except it's like a shit slide. Diarrhea slide. Okay, we can't use the, the... Hydrant. Jimmy! Cable car. Here? Why not? Pretty linear at the moment. Uh, I'm, I'm not even touching up. It's just if you go to the ladder, you just automatically go up, as it turns out. We can look down and see if we can see anything. We can't. We can look in here. What? Well, no! Oh, she's oh no! You can you can cancel it and turn it the other way. I can see a zombie in there. I can see two. In fact, I can hear them too. What else can we see through this little grate? Jimmy. Um. Okay, so there's definitely two zombies. Pop. Pop. Okay, can we get this guy before he gets to us? Apparently not. Go down. Give me my knife back. Uh oh. <laughs> Panic! Or is my knife not get backable because it's 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 fully done so? I think that might be the case actually. Oh well they're somewhat down. I think that guy's slightly moving, but it might just be the character model. Copy of emails to Umbrella HQ. Okay, Director Owens. There are alarms going off all over the nest. I don't know what's going on, but I can hear gunfighter gunfighter? Gunfire. And I can't reach my se section chief. We're trapped. Please send help ASAP. Okay. Direct Director Owens. The situation here is dire. Nest has been contaminated with the virus. It's unbelievable. The failsafe system didn't activate at all. Is this the work of the outsiders? I can't imagine who else it could be. But why? Uh, Maya and Kim are dead. Oh, poor Maya and Kim. I can't stop coughing. Why won't you answer me? Because he's a dick. Director Owens. You. It was all... Uh, it was all a... Okay, don't be a zombie. Alright. Another one of these bad boys. Let's try S... No, not SVI. Let's try... S S suck. It's not suck. What about... Uh, okay, we could be there for days. Hopefully we find that at some point. Uh, okay, a big thing of glass. Is something going to come flying through here? Can we use this control panel? No. Uh, why, friend? Why? Just stay down. That's right. <laughs> oh, hello. Uh, why? Oh, oh, missed. No. oh, no. Oh, okay. 
asshole. Apparently I'm not very good at aim with this thing. Oh shit, he's coming in. He's coming in hot. There you go. Have you got anything on you that we need? No. But do you, were you hiding anything? You were. You fat bastard. Alright. Um, we need another knife or a grenade or something. We do have some, obviously, in, in storage. But storage, she ain't here. <laughs> okay, so we've got triple zombie. I don't I was about to say, I don't know if they're permadead or not. Uh this guy is not, but we might be able to just go down this ladder. And it and not be a problem. Although if he drops on us now, we're we're not in great position. Hopefully he doesn't back rageous. Sherry? Why didn't you stay in the house? It was Sherry. safe there. Hey, Sherry! Uh, I was scared. Those things were everywhere and... You should have called the police. That's what we taught you. Uh, I did, but nobody came and you didn't answer your phone, so... Sherry, uh, I don't have time for this. Uh, okay. Uh-oh. Uh Giant claw. Sherry's mom is is Sherry! Sherry, I'm coming! She reminds on, me of Gillian Sherry. Anderson a little bit. I'll be right there. Uh okay, so the zombie I don't think he's gonna back rages. Ammo, fantastic. Raccoon milk. Mm-mm! <laughs> Nothing like raccoon milk in the morning to get you going. Uh what is this? It's a pamphlet. Greetings from the CEO. Thank you for your interest in Knight's Construction Company. Over the past 20 years, we've had the honor to work on the sewage system, uh, sewer system of some of our country's greatest cities. Or never losing sight of the two of our principles of playfulness and superior... Playfulness? And superior industrial design. At KFC, <laughs> we believe that just because our work is uh, subterranean doesn't mean our designs have to be subpar. More refined than a queen, more polished than a knight, and pleasant as a pawn, our work is sure to bring great victory to everyone involved. May we all meet on the field someday. Cat hair attached to my face. Knights Construction Company CEO, World Chess Alliance Honorary Member, Raccoon Chess Club Honorary Advisor, Fisher Chess Lovers Guild Honorary Director, R.B. Fisher. Okay, I don't think that's important. What is this? This is a... I don't know what that is, actually. Is that a v v VHS tape player or something? I don't know, it's freaking old school. Then again, it was like 90s, right? So maybe. Uh, we can put this away. We can take out another knife. How many knives do we have? We oh, we got this, like, already half-broken one. That'll work. Uh, do we need anything else? Shit. We sh should have picked up that blue herb. Because I don't know how we're going to get back up there. Well, we need to get back there with that... Um, spinny circle thing, right? So it doesn't really, doesn't really matter, I guess. Um, we've got two green herbs. We've got mixed herb. We, we got a lot of healing. Flash grenades. Okay, I think they're pretty good. Okay, so there's this door. There's also this. Sewers map! <laughs> it's not gonna help me. It's not gonna help me at all. But thanks! Okay, this seems to be, like, a proper way to go. Let's check over here. Warning, cube out. Okay, we're gonna need three fuses or something. Electronic part. Okay. Just... Put it back in. Plug in. Electronic part. Okay, so we need, we're gonna need one electronic part. Pawn plug. Let's examine. This is a bishop plug. This is a something. And this is a something. Okay. So we don't know... Well, this is the bishop. This is a pawn. Okay. So we know that the pawn goes over here. There's no indication that that was right, but we know that that's right. 
So we'll just put the bishop one in here for this for the moment. Uh, considering we don't know which one it is. When we get the third one, we can come back and play swapsies. We've got another note here. Unlocking the U area door. I lost the thing that tells you how to unlock the door to the U area during the last mad dash for a transfer of a transfer. I know you have to stick one plug in each terminal, but if anyone remembers which plug goes where, please be a pal and share by posting the info on this board. Pretty sure the rook and knight are the same wall. Wait, is there more? Oh shit, there's more. Alright, hold up. Okay, that's a knight. Which we know, but I'll examine it just in case. Knight plug, okay. Sweet. Uh. Okay, so we need, what, three? Three parts? But let's read this. Pretty sure the rook and knight are on the same wall and the bishop and queen aren't next to each other. The queen and rook were opposite each other too. Okay. So the queen and rook were opposite each other. So let's say that that's the queen, which makes that the rook. Um, Cause the queen, it can't, no, so that has to be, either that's the queen or that's the rook. It doesn't really matter, but both of these a queen and rook because if that's the queen and rook have to be opposite each other that's the knight so opposite the knight can't be the queen or rook opposite the pawn can't be the queen or rook so the bishop comes with us what else did it say uh pretty sure that the rook and knight are on the same wall makes sense and the bishop and queen aren't next to each other okay so that means that the bishop goes either here or here so if we say we put the bishop in here, uh, the queen, the queen and the bishop can't go next to each other. So that means the rook goes there, the queen goes there, and something else goes there. But again, once once we get all the pieces and stuff, we can have a play. Uh, but I think I think we nailed that. I, I think it's just either this one, put bishop goes in there, or in there. I think that that's the only thing we don't know. Um, let's have a save. If someone knows how to do the door, da 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 da, and then they write it cryptic as hell. <laughs> Amazing. So we, somehow we can't squeeze through that giant gap. That's fine. This cord power label. C cable thing is leading I don't know where to let's pull this and find out okay that's made a bridge which is good it's also woken up the, all the dead uh, I'm tipping that this guy comes back to life because he's just precariously placed there but I'm um, part of me thinks maybe he's not because if he was going to come back to life he would have come back to life when he heard that right uh, there's nothing on the roof that's going to fall on us. Should we just pop this guy once? Okay. Nice. Not good. It's fine. What are you talking about? It's hard to do a single shot with this. Seriously? There's a safe there as well. It looks like. <laughs> Fuck you. Okay, he's, he's getting harder to hit. Now that he's far away. I hear another one. Or is it the same one? It might be the same one, actually. Maybe we can get him to die and fall down, like, into the water? Oh, no. Come on. He did not fall into the water. Okay. Let's try this way. There's a, a red herb. Okay, this seems to be the way. The way way. Uh, we do have access to our bank just back, so we can run and put that back. That's fine.
Oh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> nice. Uh, head plant that, you son of a bitch. Okay, we have no idea what the combination to this safe is. So let's not even bother with that. Got another blue herbage. We They've been giving us increasingly amounts of blue herbs. Which makes me think... Oh, we can go in here. And there's an office of fat pants. <laughs> uh, which makes me think that poison's coming. Right? <laughs> Oh, doubles. Okay. Maybe we just do this. Save some ammo. Come on, you're on fire, dude. That was supposed to save me ammo, not- is up with you? What the hell is up with you? Okay, we got two ways to go. Let's go back this way. If he's not fully done, I don't know, because he, he face-planted that pipe pretty hard. It was nice. Um, let's just check what's over here. Because there's, like, computers and shit. By computers, I mean one computer what is this oh that's the spinny the spinny tool that's what it is it's a tool <clears throat> a t-bar valve handle a t-shaped valve handle perfect and a syringe double syringe radio duffel bag come on man as if you wouldn't check the freaking duffel bag it's bursting with goodness it's probably like you know. ID wristband required for cable call entry. Okay. Meep meep. There's probably like some freaking um like chocolate bars and, and, and like a, a latex sex suit and stuff in there. Alright, what else have we got? We got I thought we would have at least found one of those um chess pieces down here, but no. Delivery receipt. The item below has been delivered to the location specified in your order. Heat resistant safe. Right, the combination is written on the side of the safe in chalk. Okay, we didn't even look at that, but that's dumb, but sure. Please remember to raise it before you use the safe. Okay, well, let's go back to the safe then. Providing that's the safe we think of, we're, we're, we're talking about. Um, ID wristband required for cable car entry. Me, 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 me. Seems like there's a gas leak here as well, which is not fantastic. Okay, written in chalk on the side. Not on that side. There we go. Left 2, right 12, left 8. 2, 12, 8. Okay, so... Oops, I already stuffed it. <laughs> 2. Oh, yeah. Every time I'm going to stuff that up. 2, 12, 8. What's going to be in here? Chest piece? Ooh! Oh, that's probably what... Reinforced frame, SL60. Uh, reinforced custom part of the SL60. Made of stainless steel. This frame allows the gun to fire special high-powered rounds. Okay, so the SL60, thinking about it... Um... Because we just got those high-powered rounds, right? For it. Must have been the original gun we started with. So if we go back to our bank. We upgraded to, like, the, the, the Chris model. Like, handgun, whatever. <clears throat> and then uh, we also then got this JMB one as well. But the SL60, there it is. Take it out. Uh, so if we combine that. That's annoying, man. It means we're going to have to carry this around as well. So I wonder... I don't want to carry it around right now. Although it is giving us stuff. So we probably should. Um... Oh, I should probably save it, too, eh? 
Um, yeah, we probably should carry it around with us. If it's giving it to us, it's giving it to us for a reason, right? <clears throat> Maybe, like, you need the high-powered shots to shoot Eyeball Joe or something. But we're gonna go without for the moment. What I will do, actually, sorry, is go back and get some more, um, SMG ammo, because we've only got, like, 28 spare. Um, what I want to know is can you split it? I don't think you can, which is irritating. No, you can't. That's really annoying. Alright, well, I guess we're putting that one back. Okay, we got ammo for days now, which is not bad. We also have all those high-powered white things as well. Uh, misc. Whoa, 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 whoa. Tutorial. Where is it? Uh, combining items. Did I go past it? Hand grenade, flash grenade, combat knife. Alright, there was... This is a gunpowder. Here it is. So, normal gunpowder is handgun ammo, uh, is gunpowder times two. We know that. Gunpowder plus high grade gunpowder is acid rounds, which you can't use yet. And then submachine gun ammo is two high powered white gunpowders. So really, the high powered white gunpowders is submachine gun ammo, or you mix it with normal gunpowder to make acid rounds. Uh, we pretty much want all the, like, we can't really, we can use acid rounds now because we've got the grenade launcher. Um, but we probably want to use the normal gunpowder for handgun ammo as a backup. So what we might do is I might just take two of these out and combine them just to see how, how much ammo it actually does make. <clears throat> how many of them do we have though? Um, we should have heaps, right? One, two, three, four. We only got four, really? I thought we, we would have had heaps more than that. Seems like we pick it up all the time. Okay, so combining these together makes 88. That's not too bad, actually. I was like thinking maybe like 40 or something. Um, thinking about it, let's put that back out. Okay, now it. Convenient save. Yes. So we've got three more of those white gunpowders. So we could, with a normal gunpowder, make some acid rounds if we want to. Uh, but like I said, I, I think maybe just the normal gunpowder for handgun ammo, because you don't get up. No, you're just convulsing. Okay, that's fine. Uh, normal gunpowder handgun ammo it seems really useful. Okay, the, the dude, the Asian looking dude that we killed on the on the stairs has disappeared. But fatty burnt burnt fatty has not disappeared. Don't don't you get up. Is the Asian dude back? He is! What a son of a bitch! Okay, <laughs> there he goes. Uh, we got another fatty too. Man, how did I know there were three? Okay, green herb. We just went back to town. Okay, we'll take it. Alright, we've got that which is going to open that. Is that a shortcut back to where we were? I think it is actually. Let's see what else we've got in here. The one grenade to take out them wasn't too bad. Okay, has he got anything on him? No. So let's just leave him alone. Okay, we need the tool for this. Th and this is the other side of the other? Is it? No, it's not. This is a whole different place. Alright. 
So we need the tool. We can go back. We can, that means we can put the green herb back as well. And that is a shortcut back, surely. Okay, so what we'll do... <sighs> we'll run back. <clears throat> Which is a bit inconvenient, but it's not too bad. Put away the green herb. We'll take out the T-bar valve. And we're good to go. So we've got two two ways to go, both of which need the T-bar valve. Uh, maybe we'll go back. And try like the first bit first. Oh, then again, then again. What was that? Was that eyeball, Joe? Oh no! Don't get in the water, dude. What are you doing? Hmm. That's not the best, is it? <laughs> it's not the best. Uh, it didn't look like it wanted to follow me, which is nice. I appreciate that. I couldn't tell what it was, though. Whether it was something different or whether it was a, a more evolved eyeball Joe. Uh, do we have it back in inventory? We do. Okay, I was going to say, if it just took it and it was one or the other, that would suck. That's living, whatever the hell that is. <clears throat> are these eggs? They are. Well, they're, they're, they're something. There's intestines and stuff, intestines. Do we pop it? Okay, that did nothing. Oh, I don't want to go in any of this shit water now. Not only because it's shit water, but there's a freaking mutant in there. Well, luckily we can go up. Alright, what do we got in here? We got some keys. Sewer no entry zone. Chest pieces. Uh, a key to the section of the sewers. Good. I guess we have to... Are you going to get up, son of a bitch? Why can't I aim all of a sudden? There we go. Nope. She doesn't like aiming here. What are you doing? Aim! <laughs> what are you doing? She doesn't want to aim from up here. She she doesn't want us to cheat. Okay, I think it was because I was too close to the edge. Okay, you're going to get up? I don't even know if that hit you. Oh, you're really annoying, Claire. I don't like you very much. Oh, come on, woman. Oh, you're the worst. Okay, I think I think he's he's dead. If he comes back to life just because we've come down here and like propped him. Okay. Something has come back to life. Oh, there's someone there too. Okay. You don't seem to want to come back. She does not want to aim at this dude. Um, let's have a think about this. That, there's a green herb down there. That's the only thing I can see, but that, oh, there's this guy as well. Okay, and this guy. Oh. Damn it. Um, that section of water leads to down here.
So we're going to have to do that at some point. But that does not sound like a fun time right now. Maybe we'll check up here quickly. <laughs> Checking all the... All the roofs, just in case. Okay, here's a busted up thing that we can't get through. Which is unfortunate. Alright, well, I guess... We're going through the water. Alright, so it's either go through... Go through the shit water. Just looking if there's a raccoon figurine up here. Because this would be a good spot for one. The moths are, like, masking the, the sound of it. But there's not. Uh, we've got to go through through the shit water. It's either go through this bit um, or go back and go through where we were before where um, the, the mutant thing came out of the, the sewer. Neither of which I want to do. But I, I guess we have to do... Well, I guess we have to do both. Let's have a quick look at the map, actually. Bottom waterway... Goes to the supply storage room. Okay, that supply storage room sounds like a good place to be. It sounds like there's going to be some stuff. Workout lift. Workout lift? Why can't I read? Work room lift. Is going to go to the work room, which is going to go to this whole new place. Okay. Control room? Dial lock? Okay, that's where we were before. Um, plug socket video player all right so that's what we'll do when we come back we may as well just do this one because we're here right and and see what the hell is living in in this swamp of filth but for now we'll leave it here hopefully you're enjoying it as always thanks for watching and i will see you next time if you like this video click here to see another one just like it if you're new to the channel and like what i'm doing click here to subscribe and become the newest member of the chicken coop if you really like what i'm doing you can find a link to my patreon in the description where you can help support me and help the channel grow You'll also find a link to the channel's Discord server where you can chat with me and other members of the Chicken Coop. And don't forget to hit that notification bell.